different types of lines, used in engineering drawing. We have various type of lines in technical drawings and geometric constructions. Each of these lines will serve a different purpose by providing a specific and technical detail of construction or drawing. As a student, an understanding of the various type of lines will prove generally useful. Also, those who are into buildings, building engineers, will need to read and interpret various architectural drawings in order to effectively implement their job. The picture shows the various types of line, their description and general application. It has a stronger outline than the thin continuous line. It could be straight or curved, but with no dot or dashes within it. Thick continuous line is mainly used for representing visible outline and edges surrounding the sides that matter in technical drawings. A thin continuous line could be a straight or curved line but the main point to remember is it is a tiny, thin, line with no dot or dashes. A thin continuous line is used for representing the following's projection lines, hatching lines, construction lines, short center lines, measurement lines, diagonal lines used to state plane surfaces, intersections, leader lines, backside section lines, these lines are drawn only with the hands and without a ruler or another similar ruling material. Note, the freehand line is similar in function to the continuous thin irregular line. The freehand line serves the following, limits partial views, interrupts views and sections, used as the limit to an interrupted view when an axis is not present. This is a straight line in the zigzag direction. Please see the diagram. Below are the uses of continuous thin straight zigzag line, they are used for representing long break lines. They are used for limits of partial views if the limit is not an axis. They are used for limits of interrupted sections if the limit is not an axis. These lines contain short tiny, thin, dashes within it. Short thin dash lines are used for representing hidden details and edges on an object representing hidden outlines. Below are the uses of dashed thin lines with dots. They are used for center lines. They are used as line of symmetry. They serve as axis lines of symmetrical drawings. Chain thin line with thickens. Please see the diagram. They are used on cutting planes. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel.